Hey, what is up, everybody? It's Prodigy Matt Pioneer right here, and today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get the Frost Beards mug, which looks like this, the Frozen Shard, which looks like this, the Frozen Crown, which looks like this, and the Glacial Ward, which looks like this. I put them all in one video because they have similar processes. And yes, I figured out how to get the Frost Beards mug. Shout out to YouTube or the FBI, not the real one, but the one that plays Prodigy told me all this information. So what you need to do first is you need to collect something called Frozen Somethings. Well, what are those? So, as you can see, my mouse is scrolling around it right here. It's a question mark block in an uh, ice cube. So what you gotta do is you just click on it, and then you get it. And I don't want to battle that. I'll come back, wait. Yes, you click on it, and then you get it. So it's called a frozen something. So, there's a question mark in an ice cube, you just click on it, you get it. So, yeah, you can check your backpack to see the amount you have, but that doesn't matter. So what you want to do next, is you want to go into the furnace room, the store right here. And you want to click on a furnace that you have already lit, like this one. I've already lit this one. So you just click on it, and it's and you trade them for ice crystals. I don't know how that magically works. I don't think a furnace is a robot. You just throw something in, and then boom, an ice crystal comes out. So you keep doing that until it says the furnace is already lit. That means it ran out of frozen somethings. So what do you want to do next is you want to click on your backpack. You want to go to items. You want to find ice crystals this will show you the number you have so here i have 43 ice crystals so what you need to do is that when you get to 25 ice crystals you go to the miner in shimmer trip mountains and then you can trade that for what is it again the frozen crown yes when you get 50 you can trade it to the miner Four. I'll actually show you where he is. The glacial ward. When you get to 75, you can change it for the frozen shark. Finally, the hundred, which is the longest one. You can change it for the frost beard bug. You don't know what I'm talking about if you don't know where the miner is. He's just like a merchant guy in the rude entrance, and I'll be just walking to him. So you don't have to be there. Yeah. Okay, so what you need to do first is you need to go up over here to the treasure room. And then what you want to do is you want to battle these two monsters right here. And then you want to go, want to go into this cave right here. And I'll come back to that. Okay, so yes, you defeat these two monsters. And after you go there, like I said before, you go into the cave right here. Remember, go into the ruined entrance. So we get to here, it's called Mountain Pass. You don't need to battle this guy right here. So what you want to do now is you want to go down here. You want to battle this Bataram right here, and then go to the cave right there. Okay, so, go to the cave. So remember, like I said before, ice crystals are not like a currency. Just get to a certain amount, and then you just give it to him. It's like bounty points, basically. Click on him, and then he will, like... Give you the prize. If you if you didn't reach enough, you'll say when your next reward is at. So obviously, fifty is glacial ward, and that's what I will get my next award. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to give it a like. Make sure to subscribe to my channel for other great tutorials like this, which actually help. Yeah, actually, this video should help you. And goodbye.